we met because you were sitting on some uh, idle inventory when you were doing a, re a rebrand to, so, to your new, uh, new product line there and you had some older older stock. Great, still great inventory, great, great products. It's just the old brand mm -hmm. and old label. So um, tell us about BarterPay, your experience with BarterPay and how you've been able to leverage uh, that inventory to get the full value you know, in barter credits and then use that. It looks like, I looked on your account, it looks like you've been using a lot of it for printing and marketing. Printing, and, yeah. yeah. Printing's a big thing, yeah. Yeah, printing is huge for us as well as SEO services and mm -hmm. um, like gifts like flowers, fresh flowers to be sent to like either team members are going through a hard time or vendors that we're really wanting to impress or buyers. Um, yeah. So it's been awesome for us to be able to turn idle inventory that otherwise would literally just get thrown out because like you said, it's just the packaging. Like it's not like the product inside of the box is old or different or yeah. outdated. It's just the old branded of like the boxes. So yeah. it's nice that we're able to still use up that old inventory instead of throwing it out. We have a real focus on sustainability as a brand at Free Ships. So I love how this means that we're not creating more waste and that these things are still going to use. And so like you mentioned, the fact that we're able to get it full value is amazing. So I don't think that we've paid for printing for the entirety of this year and like the majority of last year as well. We've just ordered everything from printers through Barter, which is incredible. Yeah, it's taking that sunk cost inventory, like you said, would just be wasted and, and go, you know, be discarded, um, turning it into full value and then replacing an entire line in your budget, which is your printing budget, right? So it's, which is then turns into more marketing. Uh, exactly. And so it produces more cash, cash paying customers. So that's, uh, that's a really, really great way to uh, utilize barter credits. And actually I want to show you one of the recent um, print jobs that we did through barter. It was to launch our new night cream. Mm -hmm. So we came up with uh, the idea for a nighttime storybook for kids. Wow. So all of the printing and it's like full color prints. I think we had like 1500 copies made or something like that, like really great quality. And uh, all the proceeds from the sale of these books go towards Make-A-Wish Canada. Um, I was diagnosed with a brain tumor two years ago. Um, so Make-A-Wish Canada is really near and dear to my heart because I believe in the value of hope in your recovery process. Mm -hmm. So we donate proceeds from this book as well as 10% of all of uh, the business's profits towards Make-A-Wish to support young children and adults with brain tumors and brain cancers. So since this was basically a marketing expense that we're not making any money off of, it was great to use barter credits to cover the cost of the printing so that the cost of like $5,000 in printing wasn't really something that limited us from being able to do an activation like this. Amazing, awesome. it's an incredible story um, and tying in the social impact part of it as well, which is just uh, fantastic. and. It really just goes full circle with your whole product and being a sustainable brand. And, uh, you know, you, you got a room full of, of business owners that have never bartered before. And a lot of times people are like, you know, what's that? It's, they're kind of like leery about the whole idea and the concept. But uh, what would you say to a, a room full of, of business owners and entrepreneurs who are looking uh, into new ways to, you know, fund their business, to offset costs, to move idle inventory, uh, this whole concept of organized bartering? Yeah, I mean, I would say to them that I hear you. I understand the concerns. I had some of those concerns when I first got started on Barter as well and first learned about it because it's one of those things that almost sounds too good to be true. Mm -hmm. So you're like, okay, well, even if I get rid of this, like, am I just going to be left with like these like Barter do dollars or trade dollars that I can't actually use anywhere? But with the network that your team has developed, it makes it so easy to find things that are valuable that you can actually spend on without having to spend real money. Um, and you can spend this virtual money instead. And it's just great to know that you're also supporting other local businesses in their barter accounts so that they're able to get things for less than they'd be able to otherwise. Mm -hmm. um, so it's been immensely valuable for us in being able to offload slow moving or old inventory and packaging um, and turn that into real value that moves the business ahead.